This is a tutorial for uploading graded assignments to Gradescope. What you see in front of you is a PDF, scanned PDF form of a filled out answer sheet. This one is from Wednesday, April 1st. This is just an example. These don't represent any real answers, of course. This is the PDF that I've decided to upload to Gradescope. So I've saved it in a PDF form. Uh, this was done on a conventional scanner. You can also do this using a phone app. I've got an example of that right here. It looks very similar, almost identical, just a slight difference in fidelity here. Swap back and forth. Both of those will work just fine. So whichever way uh, you create the PDF, it will work just fine for upload. You log into Gradescope. And when you log in, you'll see any courses that you're registered for. For the majority of students, that will be uh, their chemistry lecture class and their laboratory class. I'm going to click on this. This is my template course. I created this just for the purposes of the uh, tutorial. I'll click on that, and it will take me to my assignments page. And this shows me that I have one current assignment. Uh, and this is my Chem 2211 sample assignment for April 1st. And you'll notice under status, it says no submission. It also shows me how much time I have left to submit this. Now I've set an artificial time limit, again, for the purposes of the tutorial. All I have to do is click on the assignment, select the PDF that I want to use. You just have to navigate to the appropriate file. I'm going to click on printer scanned answer sheet for this one. I'll click open and upload PDF. It's really just that simple. So on the screen in front of us, after our submission has been uploaded, you'll see it in the background, we get this recognition here that we've submitted our file successfully. We're going to get a receipt of our submission uh, mailed to our email account uh, so that we can verify when we submitted it and when it was accepted. So we'll click close on this. We can click through the pages real quickly to make sure everything looks good. It looks like everything went through just fine. I'll click back to home. That takes me back to my course view. I'll click on this and I just want to make sure that now I have a green icon showing me that I've submitted my PDF successfully. And that's the entire process. Good luck with your submissions this Wednesday.